Dance your way into learning, mastering English phrases. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into an interesting and lively English phrase, dance into something. This expression paints a vivid picture and adds a fun twist to the way we use language. Stick around as we explore its meaning, usage, and how it can jazz up your English conversations. At first glance, dance into something might conjure images of literally dancing your way into a room or an event. However, in the English language, this phrase takes on a more figurative meaning. It describes entering a situation, condition, or state of being in a smooth, effortless, or joyful manner. It's as if you're so light on your feet that you glide into a new scenario without any difficulty or resistance. To truly grasp how this phrase is used, let's look at some examples. 1. She danced into the role of manager with ease, highlights how someone assumed a new position smoothly and confidently. 2. After years of hard work, he danced into retirement, suggests entering retirement happily and without worries. 3. They danced into the new year full of hope and joy, conveys welcoming the new year with positivity and enthusiasm. These examples show how dance into something can be used to describe various situations, emphasizing a graceful or joyful transition. Understanding the context is crucial for using dance into something appropriately. It's best suited for informal settings or narrative writing, where there's room for creative expression Use it when you want to highlight a transition that's not just positive but also carries a sense of ease and joy. However, it's less appropriate for formal or serious contexts, where the playful connotation might not align with the tone you're trying to set. And there you have it, the ins and outs of dance into something. We hope this video has illuminated another fascinating aspect of the English language for you and that you're now ready to dance your way into using this phrase in your conversations and writing. Thank you for joining us, and remember, learning English is a journey. May you dance through it with joy and ease.